Teachers and staff at a Sharon High School were a part of an active shooter drill this morning. It was to prepare for a real life active shooting situation at that school. 27 First News reporter Derek Lewis was there during the drill. He joins us now with more on how the teachers did. Out of the dozens of classrooms here at this school, Sharon police say one teacher failed the drill by opening the classroom door while the shooter was in the building. It was a situation that seemed almost too real for some teachers. A guy with the Sharon Police Department walked down the halls firing gunshots and trying to get access to any classroom he could. The lights were out and not a single person could be seen. He wasn't able to get access. During the drill, student actors tried their luck, banging on doors, pleading for teachers to let them in. One teacher did and was given a card that read dead. The district superintendent gave his thoughts on the drill. I believe the classroom areas were very secure and that was very good. Uh, office spaces, kitchen cafeteria, kitchen uh, serving areas were very tight. But we just want to look at some of our larger areas. While there was a teacher who opened the door, one teacher built a barricade in front of his door. He called 911 and was on the phone with Sharon Police Department until the drill ended. I was thankful that it was not real, but going through my mind, I was thinking about how I hope I never have to deal with a real situation like this in my career. Sharon's police chief say that this is the first drill they've had in two years. Moving forward, they're going to decide which method is best, whether it's a lockdown, meaning keeping the students inside, or having the students leave the building to go to a safe location. In Sharon, I'm Derek Lewis, WKBN 27 First News.